All right, uh, my name is Scott Murray. I'm the assistant head of school here at Fulford Academy. Um, I am in charge of all of the academic side of things as well as being a classroom teacher. Um, I've been here for 12 years. Um, all right, well, so uh, for our students, um, because of our small classroom sizes, we have the ability to really get to know our kids and their individual learning needs. Um, so we can challenge the kids that need to be challenged. We can enrich the education for the students, uh, as well as we can provide remediation for things that they don't understand. Um, we have slightly longer class hours than most schools, uh, again, to help build in that one-on-one -on -one time. Um, classroom sizes cap at 12 students, anything larger than that, when we break the class uh, into two or more, depending on the number of kids. Um, and this provides both the students and the teacher uh, the time necessary to figure out what is needed and best address it. Um, yeah, actually, we had a, a Japanese boy a few years ago named Kai Shida, um, who has been incredibly successful. Um, Kai was with us for two years. He arrived barely being able to speak English, um, had no concept uh, of North American culture whatsoever, but he came with uh, open mind and uh, was uh, very quick to trust, um, which was great. He bought into the program fully. Um, within a year, he was completely fluent in English, um, which helped really sort of boost him uh, in his academics. Uh, he went from a student who was, you know, getting 60s and 70s to a kid that was getting high, high 80s, low 90s. Uh, he then transitioned off to Upper Canada College in Toronto, where he was captain of the rugby team, um, and he is now in university. So that was a kid who really uh, took advantage of all of the different programs that we have here at the school. He met with his advisor regularly, went to study hall with the right attitude, um, talked to his teachers, asked them for clarification or help whenever it was necessary, uh, got involved in clubs and school teams, um, just had a great attitude towards learning and towards his experience here, and uh, it really paid off for him. You are responsible for your own education. Um, everybody around you is here to help and support you, um, but ultimately it's up to you to figure out what you need to do and to follow through on those kinds of things. Um, because at some point, whether you want to or not, uh, you're gonna be in a situation where you have to do it for yourself. Um, I can say from my own personal experience that I didn't realize how big um, a deal being an independent, um, an independent student would be in the university years um, and the ability to hold myself accountable um, that my parents instilled in me was, uh, was beyond valuable. 